Wi-Fi extender versus repeater. WiFi connection from a router has a certain coverage area up to which you will get strong signals. As you go away from the router, the signals become weak, and the internet connection becomes poor. So, let's dive into the video. Number 1. What is a WiFi extender? A WiFi extender is a WiFi signal boosting device that extends WiFi signal for further coverage. However, it is quite different from a WiFi repeater as it connects to the router via Ethernet or coaxial cable. It is very similar to adding another router in the region where the WiFi signal is close to dead. From that dead zone, it extends the WiFi signal for a wider coverage area. Number 2. How does it work? A WiFi extender works by connecting to a router through Ethernet or coaxial cable. It does not amplify or strengthen the WiFi signal. It only extends the coverage area of the WiFi signal by getting connectivity directly from the router. It broadcasts its own signal through external antennas present. It is not rebroadcasting, and hence, it is more like having another router at your place. Since it transmits its own signal, it has its own WiFi network name, SSID. Number 3. What is a WiFi repeater? A WiFi repeater is a WiFi signal boosting device that extends the coverage range of WiFi signal. It comes with antennas that get WiFi signals from your router and rebroadcasts them over a wider coverage range. You have to place the WiFi repeater at a place where you have a strong enough WiFi signal. Number 4. How does it work? To make a WiFi repeater work, you have to plug it in an outlet where you are getting WiFi signal from your router. The signal strength has to be at least 50%. The more the signal strength, the better will be the rebroadcasting of the signal, and the greater will be the coverage area. Number 5. Which is best for your home? The first thing you need to do is select a router as powerful as possible to get a wide coverage range. If you have already bought the router, you need to check its coverage area and find out the dead zones. The dead zones are places where the signal strength is almost zero, and the internet connection is very slow. Now, if you see that the WiFi signal from the router covers most of the rooms of your home or office, a WiFi repeater should be perfect for covering the rest of the area. Moreover, if you find that the dead zones are not very far from the boundaries of your working premises where you need the internet, a WiFi repeater should suffice. Hopefully, you have understood the differences between both network boosting devices. Many people call both the devices as WiFi boosters as they know that their purposes are the same. There is no point in buying a WiFi extender spending more money and time in setting it up when a WiFi repeater can get the job done for you.